Hi, I'm Kim Nguyen, Director of Marketing at Speakeasy Company, and today we'll be chatting about Google Ads extensions that you're probably not maximizing in your ad campaigns. Before I get started, as usual, let's get some housekeeping items out of the way. Make sure that you have a Google Ads account. Um, if you do already, make sure that you have your Google Analytics account linked to it. And then finally, import any uh, goals in, that you have already configured in Google Analytics as conversions uh, in Google Ads. If you've ever managed a Google Ads account before, I'm sure you're aware of the basic setup of things, where you're basically targeting specific keywords and write text ads for those user searches. However, if you're not using any kind of extension or you're just using the basic expanded text ad or even responsive text ad features, that is just not going to be enough to stand out amongst your competitors uh, on the results pages. So that's where ad extensions come in. Ad extensions are additional pieces of information that expand your current text ads to make it a little bit more useful to the end user. So some ad extensions are automated and are automatically added to your account by Google, but some do require a little bit of setup time. So today we're gonna go through five that are most relevant to the alcohol beverage industry that do require a little bit of setup on your end. First is site link extensions. So this gives you the ability to add more links to your ads um, and take people to specific pages onto your site. Um, for example, a specific product page, a tasting room page, an about us page. These are all sample site links that you can add um, as additional ad extensions. To create um, a custom site link, I also recommend adding custom descriptions. This will provide a little bit more context to the link that you're adding and increase the likelihood of a click to your site. Um, it'll become more relevant to your end user and you just want to have that increased engagement. You do need at least two site link extensions on desktop and one site extension on mobile for it to appear in an ad. Um, and the number of site links that appear are totally different depending on the situation. Um, but I do recommend setting up around six uh, site links um, as a benchmark whenever you're setting these up. Some benefits of using site links is that you can easily update it and adjust any of the descriptions without losing any historical data that you've set up before. So um, Google is notorious for clearing out all of your history if you make a minor edit to your text ads and they won't do it for the site link extensions, which is uh, good. Uh, you won't lose any of your data. Um, you can also create customized site links that are specific to mobile devices. So if, it, uh, if you want to run something that is specific to proximity, it would be a great way to use only the mobile side of things. Uh, final benefit is that you can schedule these site links to show uh, sp on specific days, days of the week, times of the week, and that way it's highly relevant to the end goal that you're trying to get. The second extension that I recommend using is location extensions. Um, this encourages people to visit the physical business. So if you have a physical location that people can go to, like a tasting room or multiple tasting rooms, I highly recommend setting up a Google My Business page for each of these locations. Once you have those set up, link them back into your Google Ads account and then it will be set up as a location extensions. So basically how this works is that when someone is nearby and they're searching on their mobile phones, a keyword that is relevant to you like distillery near me or tasting room in Denver, your extension is eligible to show and it could show uh, the distance uh, to your location. So if they're on their way somewhere, they can. it shows that they're 2.1 miles away from you. Um, it shows your location's address. If you have a phone number set up, it'll also add a clickable call button. And then it also uh, allows you to have an expanded detailed uh, info about your location. So uh, things like your hours, 
photos, directions, a phone number. These are all things that can all the people can access through this location extension. So a really great way to target people, to drive people to your physical location. Uh, location extensions also runs on the display network campaigns. So usually a lot of these uh, extensions only run on the search side of things, but for location extensions, it also applies to display. So any kind of banner or YouTube ad, for example, that you're running, it can also have a location extension attached to it. The third extension is price extensions. So price extensions can, can add a little bit more value to your text ads by giving your customers a, a, a mini showcase of your products. So let's say you're selling your line of whiskeys online and you want to showcase it outside of you know shopping, for example, you can add uh, price extensions for each of your products. Um, there is a minimum of three products that you need to add as your price extensions, but it, you can add product title, price, a short description, and that way you can link it directly to the product just from that price extension ad. Um, similar to the benefits of site links, you can uh, set it up uh, on specific times, days of the week, days of the month, times of the day. Um, it could be very, very specific to when you want this to show. The fourth extension is the promotion extensions. So promotion extensions helps attract customers who are searching for special offers or sales that are specific to your business. So let's say it's Father's Day that just passed or Mother's Day or Black Friday and you have a promotion for those time periods, you can actually schedule out promo codes or any kind of monetary discount that you're offering on your site as an extension within Google Ads. Um, I really recommend use, utilizing this for um, any kind of promo code that you're running. The final extension is callout extensions. With Callout extensions, you can promote uh, unique offers to your shoppers, like uh, you offer free shipping or 24-hour customer service. And when they see these in your ads, there are kind of little mini bullet points below the text ads to show um, what's going to be uh, relevant to your business and adds a little bit more value to the long descriptions of your text ads. Um, some examples that I've seen used in the alcohol industry specifically is shipping included, the product is aged 12 years, you can add a gift message, um, and things like that have been really helpful to driving that end click or you know the end goal of people some going to your website and doing the final action of a conversion. Um, so one of the best practices that I like to really mention and highlight is that you have to be as specific as possible to differentiate yourself when you're using these call-out texts. So um, let's say you're a fruit-infused vodka, I would recommend saying something a little bit more specific than that. So made with 100% fresh fruit, for example. Um, so that's it. If there are plenty of other Google Ad extensions that are available to you for you to use, but um, these are the few that I recommend starting off with, but feel free to dive into that ad extension section of Google Ads and see what else you can utilize at this time. Um, most recently, Google Ads released an image extension. Uh, unfortunately, as an alcohol beverage uh, company, you cannot use it. Uh, they do uh, restrict some things for the alcohol industry and that's one of them. So unfortunately you can't use that one, but try out all the other ones. They're super fun um, and see what helps you reach a wider audience and increase your engagement rates. And the last pro tip I'd like to offer is if you ever get the off chance of getting an ad account strategist from Google who will help you set up your campaigns, I really recommend asking to see if they will whitelist you for any of their beta testing. Uh, typically, you're allowed to try some of Google's newest features before everyone else can. So uh, that's a great way for you to get a leg up um, amongst your competitors. So to wrap things up, if you'd like to start selling your spirits online and start utilizing some of these tips and tricks, uh, reach a wider national audience, our team at Speakeasy Co. can help. 
Uh, we handle the technology, the warehousing, and the fulfillment of an e-commerce store, and that way you can start selling your products direct to consumer, all while staying three-tier compliant. Um, we also offer digital marketing services uh, to help drive traffic to your brand shop um, using all of our industry knowledge and, of course, have the opportunity to work with me. So uh, let's scale your business together. If you think we can help, go to speakeasyco.com. Thank you so much for joining me today.